Yeah, actually, I, I only said that yesterday. Um, like it, it was 12 weeks out when the fight was after getting done, and now here we are, three weeks out. But uh, the positive in all of that as well is uh, the amount of work that I've done in between now and then is phenomenal, and I'm certainly going over there supremely confident of a win. You said you weren't worried about changing weight. Um, you thought it actually worked better for you. Yeah. How did you gradually put him on that weight and, and finding the power to come with it? Yeah, look, I mean, the, the, the power naturally just comes when, when you're not trying to diet down and cut your calories. Your body will fill, your muscles will fill up to where they need to be. On top of the uh, perfect strength regime that we have, it all works in beautifully and I can feel the power in my punches. Yeah, look, um, yeah, we've got we've, I've got uh, uh, everything covered, um, and I've, it's a it's a great bunch of guys, and um, I'm truly blessed to have this, and it obviously gives me more confidence. Talk us through your tape. Tell us about what you've got. Well, I, I have a strength coach. I have a um, coach who does pads um, and uh, and strength. Also, I have um, you know I've got uh, a nutritionist um, who also has uh, uh, health shops around Brisbane. Um, you know, I have a, a major sponsor here as well, and I've got you know um, um, a, a manager agent as well with me. So you know, I, I have everything else, and there's more people coming to join us. We have the me and media. It's all. It's just all everything that I need for this camp right now is here. And that just goes to show how serious you're taking. I know it's a long time, but it's worth serious. And you're living those standards. Yeah, no, that's it exactly. I mean, I set out with a goal to become world champion. And um, that vision to me is very, very clear. And uh, and along the way, the right people came into my life to to fulfil that mission. And now, so everybody's here. I'm ready to go. I'm going boxing better than I've ever boxed before. Um, I'm twice in the place I was before the Mexico fight. Right now, leaving here to go uh, finish my camp. So everybody's here. Everyone's doing a brilliant job, and I'm lifting for this. Twice in Everything, yeah, everything. I mean, in terms of uh, mentality, you know, I obviously it was disappointing what happened in Mexico, but it, it's very, very obvious to me now that that was meant to be, that this, that that, that set me up for this, which this is by far, you know, a, a, a bigger goal for me uh, is to capture the WBC Middleweight World Championship. So it all makes sense now, and I mean, it speaks volumes of my performance down in Mexico to get this fight straight away. Some guys could spend three to four years and might never get a world title fight again. But here we are now, ready to go and, and get that strap. And, um, and again, obviously, the, you know, the confidence that I've gotten from that, I mean, I always, you know, believed that I would, you know, that I could go down there and, I, you know, and, and put in that performance. But uh, then afterwards, I knew that I, that I did and, and that I can replicate that again. Yeah, no, you're 100% spot on. This, this is um, for me. It's about getting all the 1%. You'll see that in my team, and, and on fight night, to have that support there. This, this will probably be like a home support for me. I truly believe it will be. Um, you know, it's in a neutral ground, really, um, and all of that. And well, when I went out to Mexico, I was fearless anyway of the win when everything was against us. Now we're going in, and everything is. It seems like to me it'd be 50-50, even 60-40. In, in, in how I feel about it. So we just get down there, do the job. The support will be unbelievable. And again, as I said, I'm supremely confident that, that I'll be arriving back here in Australia uh, with the world title belt. And that, you know, that motivates me to no end. Slogan's here, mate. Are you a fan of the show? Is it a catchy slogan? Oh, you know, that's what, you know, the team have been talking about. And uh, I, I had a glimpse to see what it was. And uh, yeah, I think it's funny, it's catchy, it works. Sorry? <laughs> oh, I didn't, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so in, in terms of my recovery, my body's pulling up a lot better. My resting heartbeat has dropped by about seven. Um, and that's me right now going at full pace, training harder than I've ever trained. So everything is coming really good. My body is just freshening back up again too. I was in the hole a bit because of all the volume and intensity, but uh, with the right recovery, it's all coming back good again. I'm loose now again, and I just put in probably one of my best bars ever yesterday, 
But I've been backing up my spars, just getting better and better and better and really uh, doing what it is that I need to do uh, to follow a fight plan for this fight. So I'm very, very excited and I just feel, feel great. And also just the strength of power from a sort of you have a feel this percentage increase as well? Yeah, I mean, you know, you can ask uh, Zach there as well, him and Glenn, both of them do my pads and Zach will report a 10% e increase in the last couple of fights, you know, and that's uh, a credit to the training that I'm doing and a credit to Chris Mucker to, who does my strength. And we just keep building and building. But not just that, you know, I mean, I can see that in my fight camps, but, but usually, you know, in fight, I don't, I don't, I, I can feel it, but this time not having to drain out that extra three kilos of water, I feel like we'll see it. We'll see it in the ring on the night, and it could make a, a huge impact at, at, at an earlier stage than, than predicted. He, he, no, do you know what? He doesn't. He doesn't. I, I do feel like he's taking me cheaply, and um, you know, just that movement. Um, you know, it's good. It, it's okay to look at something and go, "Oh yeah, I got that." But it's a different uh, feeling when you got in there, uh, when you get in there, and, and, and so when I see, you know, with Jeff, I've been his, he's been a sparring partner of mine for a long time now, and when I first seen that movement, um, it, it really does blitz you. You're like, you know, it's it's hard to to, to kind of grasp what's happening. When, when, when it's happening at that speed. So uh, for someone that's never, I, I believe, that's not had to face that yet, it's going to be a very long 12 rounds trying to figure that out. So, thank you.